watch, but it's honest work. Um, Chris thinks that those are displays you want me to clarify. What's going on over here? I am just trying to uh, put in a oh, and wheel swap for Monday. When you're done with this, going home to party? So Probably not. I got <laughs> two twin girls. There's the partying is done. <laughs> I partied my last time a long time ago. Sipping on some DQ. It's empty. Let's go throw it away. Step into my office. Tony. I know I can push it. What are we tinting today? Oh, uh, tinting a nice boat. Look at these wheels, dude. Ross. I think I got a boatload of jokes. Oh, <laughs> it's a Supra. It's a Supra big boat. Oh! Dad jokes. Good God. I don't know. Who's good God? This is so I am literally soaking wet. <laughs> you got hit? Oh, yeah. Yo, what's up, Ross? How you doing today? You good? Working on some stuff? See that? See? It's your orders. Oh, orders. Going to you. <gasps> what? What are we doing right now? I got a little tire and wheel package we're putting on the Explorer over here. Gonna get them all set up looking good. Working on a 2018-19 Supra boat. What type of tin are you going with? Uh, five percent. Five percent tint. Yeah. Well, I gotta, I gotta disassemble the frame to pull the glasses out and then tint them that way, so you don't get that light edge around the the frame. The professional way to do it. Yep. Yeah. The right way. She all done? She's all done. So we just wrapped up this new Wrangler. Now this thing got set up on a set of 17 by nine, negative 38 XD machete crawl wheels. So it's a true beadlock wheel, unlike all the other wheels out there that you might see that have that imitation beadlock, this Jeep's running the real deal, which we think is pretty cool. Again, cause it's just one of those more true enthusiast wheels. It's not really pretending to be anything that it's not. And that's probably the coolest part about it. So we think with that negative 38 offset, again, it's running spacers in the rear. So it's a little bit wider than normal, but you know, with the, the way it's set up on here right now, we really think this is one of the cleaner off-road ready Jeeps, you know, Wranglers that we put together here in uh, the last couple weeks. All right, so just taking you a quick peek to our drilling department here at Extreme Customs. Now, we do some services that not a whole lot of people in the industry offer, and that is we custom drill and mill wheels for customers all around the United States. Now, this particular machine behind me handles all the back pads, the opening, the center bores, and tapering the wheels, while the Haas over on the other side of me handles all the work on the front side of the wheel drilling the bolt pattern. Coolest part about Extreme Customs, in my opinion, is the fact that we can drill just about anything for anything. So, I mean, if you got that four lug golf cart you were looking to get wheels put on, but nobody makes a 20 inch wheel in a four lug bolt pattern, well, Extreme Customs is able to make those types of uh, modifications to a wheel because we get all our wheels in in blanks. So it's just a cool fact at Extreme Customs, we custom drill a lot of our wheels here and ship them nationwide. So if you're in the market looking for your wheels, make sure you take advantage of that custom drilling process we got going on back here. Well, I appreciate you guys sticking around for this week's Week in Review here at Extreme Customs. Now, we hope you got to see a little bit of a sneak peek of what goes on in our day-to-day -day operations here. Now, we're gonna be bringing you guys this type of content every week, so stay tuned for these Week in Review videos. That way, you can follow along with us and see all the cool projects we take on in the next coming weeks. Stick around, guys, and if you haven't already, subscribe to ExtremeCustoms.tv on YouTube. That's where you're gonna stay up to date on all the cool stuff coming out of Extreme Customs.